Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we are going to construct a surfacing model in Autodesk Inventor software and construct this 3D twisted profile. So let's get started. Go to new, take a standard part in millimeter and go to create. Now take a 2D sketch and select the XY plane. This will be the front view. Now go to line command. From the center point, construct a straight line and one line like here. Skip. Go to line and from this center point, one line here and escape. Now you can see when we have constructed this line, this is appearing in dark blue and these two lines are in green. Okay, so now you can see. They are not constrained properly. So select this line, make it vertically constrained. So it will be a vertical line now. Now go to dimension. Give this a height of 30 mm. Go to this and give a dimension of 1 mm. And this bottom also of 1 mm. Now go to arc command. Select this point. Make one arc. And from this arc till this bottom point, construct one another arc. Now go to tangent constraint, select this arc and select this arc. Okay. Now both of them are tangent to each other. Now go to dimension. Give this arc a dimension of radius 35 mm. Now go to vertical constraint. Select this center point of arc. This is center point of this bottom arc. And select this 1 mm point. So this point will be aligned vertically. Now go to dimension. The height of this point from bottom will be 7 mm. Okay. Now you can see the perfect curve profile. Now escape. Now select this center line. Make it construction. Similarly, select this line, make it construction. And here, select this bottom line also. This bottom, make it construction. Only this arc profile will be in solid lines. Okay. Now, finish sketch. Now, go to revolve command. Here, we'll select the surface revolve. As it's an open profile, so software will automatically select it to surface. And for axis selection, select this axis for rotation and press OK. OK. So this will be the new profile. Go to front view. OK. So this will be profile. Now go to 2D sketch. And from origin, we will select the bottom plane. Go to home view. We will select this bottom plane, the exit plane. Now go to circle command. From this center point, make a circle of diameter 20 mm. Now escape. Select this middle circle, make it construction. And select this circle also, make it construction. Okay. Finish sketch. Now with the reference of this, we will make a helix profile. So from here, take a 3D sketch and select the helical curve. Here we will select revolution and height and select this base point. Select this plane, the side plane and guide it about this green line. Click here. Okay. Now define the diameter as 20 mm and the height here of 30 mm and revolution 1. Okay. And click here. And apply exit so this will be a helix profile here now finish sketch now as we have made the helix profile we want a profile to be sweep about this curve go to home now to make the new profile from here go to 2d sketch once again and select the bottom plane the exit plane now rotate the profile 
now here we will go to the project geometry and project this joining point okay now go to line command from the center point select till this joining point now escape select this projected geometry make it construction okay now finish sketch now hide the unwanted sketches like this sketch hide this okay now only two sketches will be visible sketch 3 and this 3d sketch 1 okay now from here go to sweep command the profile to be sweep will be this line and the path will be this 3d path okay boom and press ok now rotate this so this will look like this okay a helix profile now we have two surface profiles but we only want a curve uh, helix curve or a intersection curve between these two profiles so from here go to 3d sketch once again and select the intersection curve select this curve first select this profile and select this profile so a curve will be generated along this whole profile which will be joining this inner profile and this profile press ok so here you can see this curve profile you only want this curve profile here finish sketch now hide the uh, revolve surface one so select this right click and turn off the visibility similarly select this right click and turn off the visibility okay now only this curve profile will be left now go to plane and generate a new plane about its top select this point and select this arc select this plane go to create sketch go to project geometry and project the center point go to rectangle command select two point center rectangle select this point and make a rectangle profile here of one tab one okay so of equal dimensions now finish sketch and go to sweep command so the profile to be sweep will be this and for path select this path okay and press ok so this will be the path now hide this select this plane one right click and turn off the visibility now go to circular pattern select this profile go to rotation axis and select the y axis it will ask you the count so here we will give a count of 8 and the angle will be 360 press ok now from here go to 2d sketch select the xy plane now we will make a closing profile here so from here select a two point rectangle make a rectangle profile here go to dimension give this height a 2 mm you can see the rectangle profile has shifted downwards escape now select this and drag it up and drag it again okay select this line and drag this okay now it's okay now go to coincident select this green point the center point and select this top point so this will be a middle profile go to dimension the width also will be of 2 mm now finish sketch and here go to revolve and for revolve axis so this will be the axis to revolve press ok now select this top edge go to fillet take here a fillet radius of 1.5 mm and press ok ok now we are going to make this hook profile so for hook profile select the xy plane go to create sketch now here 
गो टू सर्कल कमांड हेयर मेक ए सर्कल ऑफ डायमीटर फाइव एम एम एंड फ्रॉम सेम सेंटर पॉइंट मेक ए सर्कल ऑफ डायमीटर थ्री एम एम स्केप फ्रॉम हेयर टेक टेंजेंट सेलेक्ट दिस लाइन एंड सेलेक्ट दिस रेडियस फाइव एम एम स्केप गो टू वर्टिकल कंस्ट्रेन सेलेक्ट दिस सेंटर पॉइंट एंड हेयर सेलेक्ट द सेंटर पॉइंट ओवर हेयर ओके दिस ग्रीन पॉइंट ओके ना गो टू थ्री डी मॉडल एक्सट्रूड रोटेट द प्रोफाइल सेलेक्ट दिस गिव अ डिस्टेंस ऑफ टू एम एम टेक हेयर सिमेट्रिक एक्सट्रूड एंड प्लस Now select this edge. Go to fillet. Take here a fillet radius of zero point five mm, and select this edge also. Now select this and this, so it will be all round fillet, and apply. Okay. Exit. Now rotate this profile. Now here you can see the bottom profile is open. So select the exit plane. Go to create sketch. Go to circle command. From this center point, make a circle of diameter three mm. Escape. Now rotate it. Okay. Now you can see the three mm dia. Go to three D model extrude, and here take extrude of one point two five mm, and we will take here a symmetric extrude. And press OK. Now go to Home. Now here we will define the material. So the material will be metal, eighteen hundred F hot. Okay, this is just for appearance. So this will be the final twist profile. I hope you like the video. If you do that, please do hit like and subscribe the channel for more such videos. Thank you.